Hmm. Hello, hello. It's gonna be a Lee Sin in the jungle. Extend your senses. And I've been doing a a little Lee Sin uh, practice. The Echo wants to do a little double jungle, that's fine with me. Quiet steps. Thirty seconds into minion scan. He grabs all the smalls, I believe. Do you do? This is definitely popular in higher elos. Waste not a minute. Minions have spawned. And it's helpful. Well, that is if he gets his W to shield stun for a bit. He got level two and I didn't. Master yourself, master the enemy. We should be able to stay in lane and, uh... Give him a few more taps. Oh, let's see if he goes back. Looks like he's not coming back. Ooh. Zed coming out with that first blood. Do what we must. You don't see a whole lot of Wukongs in the mid lane. At least I don't. <laughs> Was he stopping Echo? Find 
I'm just gonna get out of here. He knows that I'm here. And I've got no pots to heal up. Waste not a minute. What's going on, bot side? Oh, can we get old Lucian? He's gonna try to do a little hidey hide. Ooh. Find your center. This is gonna be my kill. <laughs> it will be my kill. That is such a misplay right there. Ho ho! I didn't know why Jungle Pantheon wanted that booty so much. So they warded that area. That's fine. Master yourself, Master. I'm gonna love paying a a visit to. Uh, Zed later on. Oh, Zed, what are you doing, crazy boy? Enemy killing spree. This Zed, he's trying his best. I wouldn't be overall shocked if he got that dragon, too. Extend your senses. I didn't time my uh, Q correctly. He must be pretty disappointed about that. He even got vision. Pantheon is in bot lane. Find your center. Now Zed is roaming. Said be master yourself, master the enemy. I guess he might have went back. 
Okay, there he is. So he's actually level eight. Crazy. I will atone. I guess he doesn't have his ultimate, and that's why he's playing so safe. They're all playing pretty safe right now. Yeah, he's playing pretty darn safe. And the problem here is I can't kill Lucian because Annie has her stun. I need her to use that thing. Alright, so that's unfortunate because that was obviously worded. <laughs> but bot lane. I'll get a vision ward for just such that occasion. Let's see, Tarek. Does he have a sweeper yet? Come on, buddy, you can live. Oh. Guess he can't live. Finish that off for him and head on out. Get some ward coverage with scuttles here. Zed and bot lane are particularly um find your center. Hard to gain because they are warning. This Vladimir, on the other hand, is a little more daring. It's really 
really warm? Sure is. Sorry, Vlad. Oh, well, there's your trinket. I'll headly, gladly get rid of that for you. Quiet steps. All right, there's Zed. Zed's back in the lane where he should be. Maybe we could even get a kill off on this goofer. This goof, this goofer. We do what we must. There we go. Pantheon get him? I think so. Oh! Oh, almost messed up. Alright. So we're gonna want uh, a little more damage on the field. That will do nicely. Panthen can still use his ultimate. Much for Panthen. Waste not a minute. So I don't want Zed getting that tower. And Zed's coming down. Let's see if I can clear Zed's tower. Now I'll be able to clear another tower. Oh, there we go. Not the best move to Zed to leave his tower. So I think Zed is going to be heading back. Right.
We're gonna go top. Vladimir is just a little too... Uh, Good job, bot lane. I'm gonna get a grab nin- well... Yeah, ninja tabby's alright. I've been mostly going against, uh... That Zed. And they've got... They've got two CCs. They've got, uh, Pantheon and Annie, but I've been facing... Uh, Zed so much. Master yourself, master the enemy. Come on, come on, let me live. Yes, yes. Okay, that was... That was some misplays by me. <laughs> but I'm glad I got that ninja tabby to survive that. To get some more uh, defense, head on out. Top lane. And where is he going? Did he stop him? An enemy has been oh, very nice. Gonna take advantage. Avan it we're taking taking large advantages here of their mistakes. Here in their entire jungle. I don't think I can save top now. Shut down. Yeah, I think top is gone. Oh, yeah. 
Hardly has any damage. Oh, no. Yeah, the Vlad, man. What's he thinking? He's like going back to base or something to... He's like, oh, I'm gonna get my items! Follow up wasn't even necessary. Alright. La 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 la. Listen, doing so much damage. Alright. Yeah. So I'm gonna do a full clear of my jungle. Get back. Get some nice items, nice tanky items. Randuin's and some Banshee Veil action. Okay. Waste not a minute. Oh, don't take the tower, guys. Come on. Turn on the minions. Get the minions. Oh, I gotta save that tower. So my team is snow uh snowballing at the moment. That is great. We're just gonna carry top lane all the way by or all the way down here. Cause they don't need me down there. I've got no real, I've got no reason to fight Zed. Sorry, bro. I'm <laughs> just messing around with him. <laughs>
do 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 It's good not to, it's good to not engage when you don't know exactly what's going on. And in that situation, oh. There's a Vladimir, so very high up. Yeah, this Vladimir, man. Aww. I'm killing with my Q. Many of them. Mm, could they be doing Baron? Let's check that out. No, they're not doing buddy. Right. I don't want to fight near that turret. Oh, 
fine. No more. No more of this. No more of this ham and cheese sandwich. Especially when we got bot or top. Uh. Oh, the Tarek, man. He's putting down the, the pain. Find your All right, we're gonna get head back and get lots of yummy items. Um, I don't think we need a Black Whisper this game. Now, yeah, more survivability would be nice. So we're gonna get some Guardian Angel action and some Elixir of Lives. So I'm gonna extend bot lane. Oh. Come on, guys. Extending bot lane to end the game. Extending bot lane to end the game. So they can't deal with all those minions. I'm gonna get uh, Dragon. Let's see, we're gonna get some speed boots and elixir wrath again. Yeah. Looks like Zed's being a naughty boy.
So we should end this as soon as possible. We should be able to do this. We should be getting Baron. We actually have a disconnect. Okay, he's back. But yeah, at this point you don't want things you don't want all your your work to go like badly because now some of them are getting close to their end game builds. And that Pantheon just secured the... Did I not get Baron? I cued him. <laughs> All right. So Zed, uh, all right. <laughs> all right, so Wukong got good amount of kills. Tarek, bot lane, did good. I didn't do superb, but good. Echo did fine. I did fine. I could do a lot better. I guess a lot of times I wasn't feeling like the spirit of, like, engaging. Instead, I should just rationalize what, what we should do next. And I think that was what it, like, a lot of times when you're ahead, you can feel the pressure to to keep punishing them but really you should just take objectives just end the game um the zed almost full build he could uh, assassinate anyone he wanted he got uh upgraded his trinket to deal with woo so he kind of knew what he he knew what he was doing for the most part The Vladimir, I'd say, was the weakest link on their team, and it uh, it promoted lots of uh, invades in their jungle, so Pantheon wouldn't be able to get, uh, although he did get a lot of kills. Active on the map. Let's do a little itemization. Um, standardly stuff. Two damage add items, regular, all tanky stuff, and that's good because they have a lot of early game um, dangerousness. But they got, uh, in the rare occasion that they have late game, um, you can go, you can get your Hydra much quicker and then farm, farm, farm. But even then, it's like Lee Sin, once you get the upgraded Warrior Stalker's Blade. Once you get the upgraded Stalker's Blade, Warrior. Um, Lee Sin is a... Uh, you, you get like a, a, that power spike in Lee Sin. I feel like mid... Uh, beginning to lit... Early to mid is late at Lee Sin where he wants to be. Where you can make the most plays and make the most uh, capabilities. Use, use your capabilities. So let's look at itemization. Mm, Echo, standard stuff. Got the Abyssal Scepter for dealing with the Vladimir. Very nice. 
Um, Vladimir, he had to go Spirit Visage. Um, that's interesting. A little cooldown reduction, too. Um, so he couldn't go full damage. He could have gotten an Abyssal Scepter. That might have been better for Vladimir, but the way that K Echo's kit is, maybe he has the advantage over Vladimir over time. Because of his uh, Lich Bane procs. Probably do tons of damage. Once you get items like Lich Bane, Abyssal Scepter, those do tons of damage. And they start to weigh into Vladimir's ability to heal himself. Uh, Graves, standard stuff. Quicksilver Sash to deal with Zed. Uh, Taric. Full tank. Plus uh, Iceburn Gauntlets. Which is a great item for Tark to get that, that slow proccing. And his, and his heal. Frozen Heart's great for him. Gives him mana. Sunfire Cape, health. Health. Deal with Critical Strike. Great build for Taric. Um, Wukong looks like a f almost complete full damage. Um, he was going for lots of damage. He's got his Hydra, he's got the Brutalizer, he's got Trinity Force, and he's got Last Whisper. So he was definitely like going for that 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 all in Wu Wukong ultimate where you get tons of damage off and hoping for like a large team fight. I don't think we ever had a very large team fight, I don't think. Zed um, pretty much went even in his kills and his uh, his deaths. Standard stuff for Zed. Not too much to say there. Ghostblade, blah, blah, blah. Annie. Oh, Annie. Poor Annie. Their bot lane got just... Their bot lane got pretty crushed. Um, and that might be due to the lack of... Well, Vladimir was pressured. He couldn't do anything, but you know, teleport back into his lane. And, you know, that's surprising. Annie and Illusion are pretty dangerous, but I guess because of Tark's ability to continue to heal up and stun if they try to engage made them... Uh, so, sustain with Tarek. Like, if you're... F so, in this case, if you're facing... This is a good example if you're facing a double poke lane. You got Annie poke and you got Illusion poke. So what do you do with that? Well, you get a you get a Tarek, and you continue to heal. Now there's other champions that can heal, like Nami, but they don't nearly they don't have nearly uh, the kind of um, tanky build path as Tarek does. So if you're facing a double poke lane, Tarek is the man. If you can uh, if you can sort of counter pick their play. Um, and look, like, he just went health, too. He didn't even worry about um, Annie. And Annie got Righteous Glory. This is a retarded item on Annie. I can see where... I mean, I suppose I can see it working, but it just doesn't synergize with how much damage she does. I can imagine she rush up to people, do the Righteous... You know, with Righteous Glory. And then what is this Ruby Sightstone? Did they, she didn't need that. I guess her item, her itemization was just because she was dying all the time. She couldn't get enough gold. I guess she was frustrated and got whatever she wanted. But you want to go, you want to go, you want to get that damage on Annie, get that stun damage out. Um, Lucian, standard stuff. Got Last Whisper to deal with Tarek. Um, Pantheon. Their Pantheon, Warrior, Black Cleaver. Mm, Black Cleaver, I wonder if it would have been better for him to get uh, a Hydra if he's going for a second damage item. But you do get cooldown reduction. However, I don't think... I think, well, yeah, that's debatable. Yeah, well, see, if you look at his build, though... It's kind of like he wants to get in there and do lots of damage. And for me, I think Ravenous Hydra would be better. You could do a lot of burst damage. Use Randuin's Omen to slow them down and then clean up. With autos and whatnot. 
The black cleaver, I think, is a mis mis itemization there. And yeah, and Vladimir, like you want to go full AP on Vladimir and get things like Sonya's Hourglass and whatnot. What Vladimir should have did is, well, when he lost his tower, he could do what he could to farm up his jungle. Um, farm up the left side of his jungle, blue side. And try to come back from there and try to come back in team fights because if you go full AP in team fights, there's a chance that uh, you do so much damage and you get ahead and you step up. But this fight, uh, yeah, but going this build is a little mistake and consistently trying to do a little echo. And then I was top lane so many times. You just have to be crazy. All right.